Hey guys, it is Tuesday again, which means it's time for another Tea Together Tuesday. So today, um, we are talking about your favorite brewing method and why. So um, anyways, for those of you who don't know, Tea Together Tuesday is a collab between Jan from Tea with Jan and Kimberly from Tea is a Wish blog. And we're actually incorporating Tea Together Tuesday this month with the September Sip Down Challenge from It's Tea Babe on Instagram and Tea and Me blog on Instagram. So I can't remember who came up with this prompt. If I remember, I'll put it in the description. But I know that Jan and Kimberly were actually having people um, come up with the prompts to help them out. So I can't remember who did them this time or I didn't see it actually. So anyways, I don't really have a favorite method of brewing. I just normally use like an infuser basket. However, around this time of year, I'm really liking my teas iced. So I am actually using my steeper a lot. Um, either my steeper or I am actually cold steeping in the fridge because, you know, best way to have cold tea. So if for those of you who don't know what a steeper is, this is it. This Mine's from David's Tea. I know Adagio has them and you can get them from other tea companies too. And so basically what you do is you put in your tea and then you put in your water. Um, it has measurements on the side. So, uh, and then you just let it steep up. It's got a little lid. And then when it's time to put it, um, you know, put your tea in your glass or teacup or whatnot, you just rest it on top and it like pushes this plate up that's like right under there and it makes the tea come out. So mine's not quite ready yet. I am actually, um, since this is part of September sip down, I figure I would drink some tea. So we have Pearberry Punch from The Necessities which is so good. I'll show you guys, <laughs> even though this isn't really part of the video. Um, it smells amazing, but it is like in, it's an herbal blend, so it's a fruit infusion. If you look at those giant pieces of strawberry in there. Um, then it's got like some pears and whatnot. Um, anyways, let's see. So strawberries, pear, apple, um, raspberries, marigold, marigold petals hibiscus and doesn't have a lot of hibiscus either I think the hibiscus is mainly for color um, she doesn't use a lot of hibiscus in her teas because I know a lot of people don't care for that um, I personally don't mind but um anyway so that is what we're having I'm just waiting for it to steep a little bit longer but the reason I like this method in the summertime is because when I'm putting tea on ice instead of putting it in one cup um, and then having to pour it over the ice or steeping it and then just adding ice. Um, sometimes I just I just like it better to pour the tea over the ice. I don't know why, it's just what I like. <laughs> um, and then of course you have cold steeping um, like in the fridge or whatnot. But for this method, this is great because you can have it right then. So I've got my cup of ice here and then our tea should be just about done. Um, I started it just before this video as you can see, I guess the hibiscus and strawberries are causing it to cause or change colors. Um, but yeah, this is a fruity tea, which I really love in the summertime also. <laughs> so anyways, here it is. And, you know, may, most of you already know what this does. But in case you don't, you just set it on top. And it just pours your tea right on in. So there you have it. And these are so super easy to clean. Um, I just dump the tea out. I let it sit in some soapy water um, and then it's ready to go again. So there you have it. I've got my iced tea here and, and I've got my straw. This one actually did come from the necessities actually. So she actually sent that with a, um, a shipment of tea. So. And there you have it so this is so good <laughs> if you love um tea blends and fruitier teas and stuff like that make sure you check out the necessities i'll leave her information as well as all of the people who have come together for tea together tuesday september sit down challenge and whatnot um i'll leave all their information in the description below uh, but until then you guys i hope that you have a great week and hope your september is off to a great start i cannot 
leave. We're in September. <laughs> finally. <laughs> Actually, and I say finally like it's taken a while. This year has gone by quite fast to me. So anyways, hope you guys have enjoyed this. Um, be sure to check out other Tea Together Tuesday um, posts, whether it's on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, um, blogs, wherever, um, because it is across different platforms. And yeah, hope you guys have a great evening. Talk to you soon. Bye.